Hey folks, well I've been looking at garden a bit today and if, if you might have seen if you saw my last video and um, while they're out there I was picking some lettuce and cutting some ends off and I thought I'll give them to quail and fish and freshen the water up and while I was there I thought I wonder what would happen because I've got two cages at the minute I've got four in one cage and five in another cage which is four females in one cage one male and four females in another cage I know the eggs from the um, the cage with the male in a fertile and I thought I wonder what would happen if I took the male out and put him in with the other cage would you know would the others try and fight him or whatever they are side by side so they are seeing each other all the time every day but they've ever, never actually been mixed and if I do this big cage I've got to mix them but anyway <laughs> so I put him in and I did a little film and it went all right hopefully I'm gonna get more fertile eggs and I'll be able to integrate these two uh, flocks, if you want, together. <laughs> and now I, I do say don't name your food. <laughs> but I've named him Rasputin. It's Rasputin's birthday. You'll see what I mean. Nice to be nice. I know this is another video, so soon. I might just tried a little social experiment. And that dark quail there in the middle of the camera is the male. Now I've got four females here. Didn't know what I was gonna have. I've had lots of eggs in there. And this cage I've never had a male. These were the first that I hatched. And um, I've, I've got these in here, there's four females here. There's a bottle and a water feeder here as well. I'm using both. I'm just trying different ways for watering. But I just put him in here and he's just made it all four of them. I didn't get that on the film. I think I'm just calling him Rasputin. Because now I should get some fertile eggs and not fighting him. He's not fighting them, but he's made to them all. And what I'm, I'm talking about in the last like five, ten minutes, I've just sat here and put him in there just to make sure there's no nasty stuff going on. There's a female in here that's getting quite overmated, she's got a lot of uh, feathers off the back of her neck, so this one uh, it's just walking out right now, just gone in, so she's getting quite overmated by him, but obviously by the space I've got, but then he goes again, maybe, maybe he missed her. Happy birthday, that's beauty. <laughs> we might have to get swapped over a few uh, times at the minute until we get some more hatched. I have actually ordered a, well, my incubator should be here tomorrow or Wednesday. So. to leave them in there all night and tomorrow see how it goes and then should be getting fertile eggs from both cages happy birthday mate happy birthday <laughs> give another call Good man. Happy birthday. I'm going to leave you in there all night. So fill your boats or the eggs. <laughs> Not missing him already, are you girls? <laughs> 